Hi guys, today we are going to talk about uh, what dig digital images are. So first of all, uh, basically digital image is nothing but 2D matrix with number of channels. So this matrix is filled with integers between 0 and 255. And most commonly, we are going to work with two type, types of digital image. Uh, first one is uh, grayscale image and second one is color image. Let's talk about this. And first of all, uh, we are going to talk about grayscale gray, gray scale image, excuse me. And this is, uh, this is a 2D matrix with one channel. And this one is filled with uh, integers between 0 and 255. And 0 means black and 255 indicates white. And this is the example of the grayscale gray image. Uh, and if we take a look at a matrix of this grayscale gray image, then uh, it will look like this. And just for your information, the real matrix form of this image will be more, uh, it will have a larger dimension, meaning uh, like larger width and lar larger height and width and second we're going to, we're going to take a look at uh, color image and this is also 2d matrix but with three channels and first channel is red and second channel is green and third channel is blue usually and those are filled with integers be between 0 to 255 and each integers uh, mean intensity of the reflected light from the object or scene. So basically low integer value means low intensity and high integer value indicates high intensity of the reflected light. And this is the example of the writer and if we take a close look at of the look at the matrix with through channel this will look like this all right that's page click it and then uh, there is one more slide actually <laughs> so um, uh, this is the typical digital image acquisition with digital camera so um, we take a picture of the scene or object with our digital camera and inside camera it do the processing to create a uh, color image that processing is called um, the mojeki uh, we are not going to talk about this today but maybe later and as we uh, discussed earlier uh, each of images they have those matrix forms. All right, that's basically it for today. Thank you so much. And next topic will be uh, how to read uh, how to read and write images, videos, and video stream with OpenCV in C++. All right, thanks so much. See you later, guys.